Jay, just try and put that game into words. <laughs> just a game of two halves for us. First half, we looked the shadow of ourselves. Um, we've built upon some really positive performances and results in the past. Obviously, the preparation hasn't been ideal with the, the mini COVID breakout and players not training as, as much as we would have liked them for the preparation for the game. But there are no excuses. We've come here, we've conceded a really poor goal inside the first minute. Um, they pressed us high. We haven't been able to get out and, th and then we haven't been able to get pressure on the ball and, and you 1-0 down. After that, I think it took us a little bit of time to grow into the game, to find the spaces. They sit well into the block. Um, they, they jump out at times and we just couldn't find support players and, and link our midfield um, with our defence to get out. And then when we did and we found options to play through and around their press, we had opportunities. There's a cutback that Relly's missed. There's a coming together between Shan and Relly in the middle and, and that one gets saved easily. Ems hit the crossbar, it's goal line clearance. And you're thinking, is it going to be our day? We're creating chances, we're getting into good areas. But I always felt on the breakdown, we looked vulnerable through transition. Our reaction to the transition on midfield were all over the place. Um, they were able to find spaces between our lines and the hurt us. And then to get the second goal was was a hard one to take when we felt we were getting back into the game. We changed a th few things around uh, in the second half. We managed to get plus one on our opposition, on our defensive line when building. We managed to overload the right hand side a lot, isolated them, Shirell out on the left, and we knew chances were coming. And then Ems had another one, this keeper saved it, and you're thinking, Come on, the chance is going to come on when we take one. We just need to show some composure. And not only did we show composure, we, we showed com kind of clinicalness in that final third and, and we shown character to come back and, and ultimately win the game. What was your message at half-time? The message was obviously to be better on the ball. I felt like there was moments where we weren't we weren't quicker. Our, our ball speed was, was too slow. It was enabling to get back into a balanced shape. Um, we were too reactive off our movement when the ball played players were making their movement too late and it was just about speeding our processes up our thought processes trying to play in the inner channels in the half spaces um trying to trying to create overloads wide and, and utilize the triangles wide that I felt we collapsed in the first half and and to, to look forward to the 45 minutes you, you've you've dug yourself a hole and, and now you've got 45 minutes to get back and each to a player they were superb we've we've obviously made changes Danny Lane who, who's been out this week came in gave us a big shift Sammy Quayle been out this week came in gave us a big shift Tam came out come in big shift so all these players superb and yeah really happy with it how do you prepare for the Bournemouth game on Wednesday it's obviously a quick turnaround yeah, it is. And we've got to take the positives from this game. I think there's a lot to take away that we can't forget that first half. I've said that to the players. We were too slow in transition. We weren't good enough in our 1v1 duels. Second balls, we've got to be quicker on. And we know we're going to have to step it up for a final against a, a very good Bournemouth side. But we've got to take away the second half performances. I think our combinations in the middle of the park, the way we played was brilliant. Um, the way we were able to get in the box and, and we arrived our time and an arrival in the box to get behind and get the, the, the shots off to score the goals was something we've been we've been asking for for a lot. So three scrappy goals, three scrappy points, but we're happy, we'll take it and we'll move on to Bournemouth.